My name is Angelica Jekyella and I am a human earth angel. I have high rank in heaven on this earth. I am also a humanitarian, acting in the best interest to respect all kids, those in the womb, all humans, all loved pets, animals, all other living creatures, and all nature. I have an honors bachelor of science in life sciences and Christian studies, that is Christ respecting studies. Angelica Jekela is a human being was left alone on this earth without the Holy Family present protecting me and my work for years. Angelica have been a victim of it all on the earth I don't deserve. I put information together from life experience, from my studies, on a, in a website rather, entitled Earth Angel Help. This is work by a human being an innocent human woman on this earth that has seen what has gone on in the world for years and doesn't want any more of God's loved creation to suffer in any way what they don't deserve to suffer according to the Holy, Divine, Almighty, loving grace of God, the Father, that exists in the heavens, an inalienable truth, all my work is respectful of his clean-minded ways, morally right ways, etiquette, respectful of all bioethics laws, respectful of the health, safety, and well-being of others. Angelica as a human myself, Choose not forced to do to respect my health, life, and dignity, to and cared for my health, so that my physicality is healthy as best I can keep it on earth, and a good example then for others. As everyone on earth is expected to care for and respect their own health, life, and dignity, and be a good physical example then for others. Every life affects another life. All other humans, kids, animals, loves pets. Everyone has a right to be respected and has to be considerate of others. To be respectful of themselves, a good example then, for others as when they see them. When a human is then, such as myself, respects my brain and physical health, 
choose to be and make sure I am well rested, care for my health best I can, maintain a happy life best can, as known, happiness dramatically improves human brain and physical health. When the human physicality brain is healthy and well rested, and the human such as myself cares for and respects this physicality, it is then a temple for the pure soul, for the spirit for the virtues or gifts of the spirit that only then can be used by a human that is considerate and is aware of the needs of others, uses what they learned in life to be educated in all ways then, thinking through first what the needs of others are to use this information that I learned in studies, to selflessly help others, to find ways to prevent and relieve or relieve the suffering of another of God's loved creation by performing a selfless, by free look choice, not expecting a reward or anything in return, a merciful act, an act of mercy that is. Mercy is the kindness and compassion from within one's heart and soul. These virtues, gifts, together with an act, used to prevent and relieve the suffering of God's loved creation, such as a a child, another human being, someone in the womb, an infant, a loved pet, an animal, other living creatures, loved nature, with a life that is suffering something that they don't deserve to suffer beyond their control, were affected by that the Holy in Heaven, the Holy Grace of Almighty God and His Son, Jesus, the Divine Mercy after even the people prayed for years, was not their job to do, but were left suffering, unknowing why, but seen in the world suffering, trillions of God's loved creation that I just stated. Things that they don't deserve to suffer are not allowed to suffer according to the Holy, Divine, Almighty, loving grace of God the Father. God loved humans into existence and is all-knowing God. He is the Holy Father. After many centuries, the Holy in Heaven haven't done their part, unknowing why. As just stated, they are required and have inherent in their being the holy 
divine almighty God, the Father, the Holy Grace of God, his Son, Jesus Christ, the Holy Spirit. They have the know as well what the kindness and compassion for their for God's rather loved creation is more than any human or living creature in the universe. They are benevolent holy beings. God created the laws, bioethics, that is life respecting, with consideration taken, also to respect the ethics. To treat a life so valuable according to the holy almighty grace of God the Father beyond any comprehension to this holy grace of God beyond any worth beyond any rubies gems in the universe was to have his guardian holy angels that are appointed to all, to guard, keep safe, to guide throughout life all holy guardian angels created by the holy divine almighty God, the Father, the holy grace of God, loving one. The holy protectors, the holy archangels, to protect from all wrong the love of God's creation, physicalities, brain, mind, emotions, personality, life force, itself, soul, to human ability to die, other living creatures as well, praying abilities. These holy, created by the holy grace of Almighty God, guardian angels, the holy protectors are not doing their job on the earth. It is clear to see for trillions of years. It is beyond not allowed by the holy divine Almighty God the Holy Loving Father, the Holy Grace of God, the Father. Angelica Jekela suffered on this earth left alone without the real Holy Archangels. The Jesus Christ himself, the real one that does, I know, exist in heaven with huge holy powers. His Father, the Almighty God, and the Holy Spirit. I was left alone since born with a supernatural entity that I didn't choose to be on earth affecting me, right or wrong. I don't choose to go further into details because it's beyond disheartening and no one wants to hear of this. But things happen on earth beyond human control that the Holy in Heaven, the Holy Trinity, all have huge powers and do exist supernaturally and have created these holy guardians that exist and holy protectors that aren't on earth as stated for trillions of years, even one after humans 
grown left alone on the earth, not informed by the Holy in heaven Trinity, the Holy Grace of God the Father, Jesus Christ the Son and Holy Spirit, the Holy Mary, that does exist, has huge holy powers, authority in heaven. This main holy in heaven had to respect God's loved creation, to tell them to never build any worship places, especially to in, in too cold long distances, rather, to travel to, or in too hot temperatures on earth, which how the world is existing, living, all humans, kids, love all animals, living creatures, and nature in either too hot temperatures to survive, which God, Holy Grace of God, Divine, Almighty God, the Holy Grace of loving God the Father, does not believe the human should suffer. Humans are to be living in a world with normal temperate climates proper for their physicality that God loved into existence and the parents for a, a child, a child of God to be respected by the Holy Divine Almighty God the loving grace of God the Father to make sure that they have proper temperate climate for their physicality to function at normal temperatures as he created it to be and require these proper temperatures on earth, proper weather patterns, safe, guarded and protected by the holy grace of God resources, guardian angels and holy archangels. All of God's loved creation on this earth. God always knew and he worked for six days and nights, created the universe. He even rested. He is a supernatural beyond nature, that is, entity. He's not made of flesh. Human, phys human physicality with cells and organs, brain. He is a beyond nature supernatural holy grace of God entity and even he rested. Humans have a long school or work week and exist on earth left as just stated and have world too cold to survive and have too warm. He was morally obligated, and Jesus Christ, the Divine Mercy Himself, the Holy Spirit, to inform humans that His God loved into existence humans. He loves so much. To tell them to never build any worship places that are going to be too cold too warm to travel to and too far. The human physical health will fail of trillions of people to come. If they're built, there will be pollution resulted if these places are built. Humans are gonna suffer if gas fumes pollute the environment, the water, they won't have clean water to drink. All the insects, the little eggs, infants, they have a life that God loves so much. And all the grass has a life that loved so much. The trees, God loves. Little flowers. They have a valuable life of holy loving grace of God loved each one of them. All those in the womb of humans, the humans, all other loved pets have a valuable love into existence life, so valuable to re be respected rather by the Holy Divine Almighty God, the loving Holy Grace of God the Father, is morally obligated to tell humans this information and they had a right to know.
to to not suffer, to not leave their health failing. To tell them God's day of rest is on Sunday. To even rest others on Saturday as well. To rest their physicality. That after being left to exist in a world that's too cold, too warm, affected by the elements or other patterns, a human physically has to rest on weekend and Sundays especially. And it is actually God's day of rest. The whole universe knows this. And humans are already physically strained, shivering, burning calories, working just barely to survive enough money for shelter out of the elements from cold rain, some too hot temperatures, and require then their physicality to rest. They go to school, learn best they can what they're good at, then hopefully get a job and have to be physically healthy according to this holy, divine, loving grace of God the Father are judged internally every human, every living creature, even in the womb. All insects, birds, all types of living creatures, nature, all judged, recorded in their whole life by the Holy Almighty God, by the heavens, recorded in their life how they treat and respect their own physical health, brain, body health, if they are considered then to be and have to be of their mother that took care of them, respected their health, life, and dignity in the womb for nine months to make sure they're born healthy into this world. The parents, the father then as well, caregivers, teachers that raised them, humans till 20 years old approximately, have to be respectful humans expected by these this holy almighty God rather and those in heaven and Jesus to morally do right and respect their temple, this physicality that God loves so much, that they have to respect their health and be a good example as well for others. But the holy grace of God the Father is not on earth monitoring this, and he knows, he stated, knows all and sees all. The holy grace resources, guardians, angels, archangels, especially didn't stand on earth to prevent these worship places from being built. Even the one in Jerusalem, where the temple is there, the church of the Holy Sepulchre, where Jesus' tomb is, since many, many, many years, since after he died, a huge church in the Holy Land. Not one of the holy in heaven prevented from human suffering building this church. Those that have the all superior heaven reasoning, holy grace of God, true reasoning abilities, and to love their creation, to leave human suffering building bricks, suffered slavery, affected in building, excavating deep grounds for churches even in holy land. To worship the holy in heaven physically, with physically harmful to health, brain, body, nervous system, heart, muscles, health practices of worship, of reverence, respecting, practicing the holy fear of Almighty God. Jesus Christ, the Holy Spirit, loving the Holy Grace of God, the Father, the Holy Jesus, the Holy Spirit, the Holy Mary. Respectful of the saints, all holy in heaven. Not one of them stood on earth. To prevent these churches from being built, the Holy, the Vatican, 
monasteries, huge cathedrals, basilicas, stairs that after human is not required to do. A human is actually required to rest on Sundays, as I stated, and respect this according to the Holy Divine Almighty God, loving grace of God the Father. So that their physicality, temple that he loved and mother and womb, and others that raised them and humans respect this, are expected to do, are judged. To rest on Sundays and then are healthy, a good example, and can use their pure-hearted soul gifts and virtues to help others. When they're physically healthy and well-rested. To perform seven, one of the seven rather, corporal or spiritual works of mercy. from the kindness and compassion of their own heart and soul. A merciful act to prevent or relieve the suffering of someone, one of God's love creation. What they don't deserve to suffer, homelessness, being thirsty with not enough money, not enough food, not enough water, not enough clothing. And there are the other ones I didn't state. The holy in heaven were expected and by God's truth, his words are, he cannot go back on. He has to maintain order in the universe. He, he failed, has no right to do. And knows he can't. His son, Jesus Christ, lived on earth as a human man, and his parents, the Holy Mary, Saint Joseph, his early father, they they after died they went to the heavens. They have huge holy powers in heaven. They stated and knew what it was to see suffering humans left alone without holy God, grace, resources, even millions of years ago, where Jesus, when he was alive, rather. The Holy Mary and Saint Joseph. Jesus Christ had to even and travel as stated to teach these words of humans to respect their physicality, this temple that God loved into existence to respect their mother in these ways as I stated and those that raised them for humans to continuously think of this first in their life to respect this and then are judged accordingly by the heavens if they do right about these or not uh, if they do wrong if they don't morally rectify these they have severe punishment after they die in hell Jesus said these words that I stated to his disciples, other humans, followers, he's seen suffering. He said a human has to be well rested and physically healthy and in a temple proper, physically that all his brain, organs, life, or soul as every human and living creature belong to God. Then a temple for the pure soul. Spirit can then use these virtues, gifts of the spirit humans have to selflessly help others. To prevent or relieve, to stop the suffering, relieve it of something they're suffering beyond their control that affected them and are affected by that holy divine almighty God the holy loving grace of God the Father doesn't believe and doesn't allow them to suffer. But humans were left on earth for some reason suffering this. Jesus was on earth as human and spoke these words to teach humans to do these works of mercy when they can. To help what the human can do. To prevent or stop or relieve their suffering. To donate 
money to the poor, so enough food, basic necessities of life, shelter, water, enough clothing, others to help bury the dead, different, all these means, corporal and spiritual works of mercy, a human to do when they choose by free will of choice, not forced to do, not expecting a reward or anything in return. From the heart and soul, kindness and compassion using these virtues. When performed as a merciful act, they make another human's life easier to live. The human is has their life is made easier to live. They have joy brought to their heart and soul, happiness. That someone remembered them and cared enough for them to help or prevent them from suffering or relieve their suffering in a way they don't deserve. Then they are healthy, happy, and they have had a heaven transcended to them from a kind human. What years ago was Jesus taught to his disciples? From the pure kind heart, kindness and compassion of one heart and soul, transcended heaven through a merciful act to a human, now overwhelmed with joy, healthy and happy as they rightly deserve, not suffering hungry, not suffering left alone, not suffering without enough clothing, not suffering with enough food and water. and already have transcended then heaven on earth to them that they rightly deserve. That they were to be living on this earth and never suffering anything, according to the holy, divine, almighty God, the loving grace of God the Father. When Jesus, after he died, he stated the words that he would never leave humans to suffer alone on earth after what he's seen on earth. His Holy Mother, as well, and Saint Holy Joseph. They have huge holy powers in heaven, is beyond words. They can miraculously heal humans within split seconds, and yet there are no miracle workers on earth. They haven't physically came to earth even though it's different, they are in supernatural beyond the nature realm. I know what the miracle capabilities are of the holy loving grace of God, the protective abilities of the archangels, the holy guardians. I know it's true. I have affected been by different things on this earth, but the real in heaven are not on earth doing the job. It is clear to see for all centuries, millions of years. It is not allowable what they have done in the heavens and not knowing why. But they cannot go back on their words. They left humans suffering on the earth, horrendously beyond, and this is the main thing I as a human am against entirely, and I was a devout Catholic, not told by any holy in heaven and a right to be. I figured this out after all the years, 20 years going to church every Sunday. I had a right, like everyone else, to be informed. It's God's day of rest. Stay home where it's safe and healthy you'll be. And to prevent getting ill on the way, even common cold virus, which every human has a different one. Germs, others affected by seasonal allergies. Stay home, never drive to the churches. They're too far, all of them. 
It is too cold to go out when a human on Sunday after went to school whole six days and nights left already suffering in Canada states is too cold in most world for human to survive to function healthy their physically as it is and half the world in too hot temperatures dehydrated and suffering physical health failing that way that they don't deserve according to God but travel to long distances right to know like myself as child growing new cells organs still till approximately 20 years old learning new things takes a huge amount of calories vitamin strain on a human child growing entirely new cells organs developing a new immune system till approximately 20 years old to adult. Most humans are not focusing on this on earth. The Holy God and Jesus even more. The mercy to prevent this from happening. The divine mercy, the human as I said, seen on earth suffering this way with holy powers told his truth. He cannot go back on and to and send the resources to the earth for millions of years the holy guardian angels that are appointed commanded by the god to be present by every human on earth to guard them from all wrong to guide them through life till the day and after is needed especially when they choose by free of choice for them to be present the holy archangels, protectors. To make sure that these jobs of these priests, ministers of every religion, rabbis, ministers, Protestant, Presbyterian, Buddhists, world leaders, Dalai Lama, the Pope, which is, they are considered their job. They are the human representatives of God. The Holy Divine Almighty God, loving grace of God the Father on the earth. They have to be a good physical example respectful of their temple physicality that all belongs to the holy loving grace of god be well rested educated very well educated in health matters and in spiritual matters respectful of their physicality temple and respectful as years went on know about the main bioethics life respecting laws and health safety the laws of the holy divine almighty god loving grace of god the father that are in place on earth in the entire universe that have to be these priests educate about simple can be easily done and have to and know them inside out and respect them on earth themselves and promote to others to respect the health life safety and dignity well-being of one their own life their mother that cared for respected their her life to be born and healthy and womb for nine long months the father those that raised them educators teachers elementary high school university taught them to respect their health life Raised them, taught them best they can, what they're good at. Those that choose to have a job, to be a priest, and are asked when employed if they're going to respect their health. Physicality, be a good temple for their soul, clean mind, spirit. A good example for other humans, other of God's loved creation, other than them. Disciples as of Jesus withstanding there knowing his holy father's will clean-minded respecting ways etiquette morals and laws the laws just stated 
one life to respect another life. Their freedom of choice, their rights, their dignity, their God-given dignity. It is that referring to a valuable life. A brain, physicality, emotions, life or soul, human ability to die, praying abilities, a physicality that belongs to this holy God, loving grace of God, holy one. Respectful of those the mother has stated in the womb and all that raised them have to keep in mind first. At all times, out of respect of themselves and those that raised them, in mother cared for in womb, all the priests, ministers, all religious worship leaders in the world. To respect be up to the educated about the laws easily done online these days, preventative any pandemic measures, to prevent the spread of germs, that they know every human themselves have germs different than every other human, animal, pet, living creature. To be considerate of this, as Jesus will be on earth, Then a pure temple, physicality for this pure soul. Then can only then use their gifts, virtues valued highly by heavens in them to selflessly, by free of choice, not expecting reward or anything in return, and to use their God given talents, a priest, minister, pope, and any religion other worship religious leaders to have a speaking talent, singing talent, educated, to will only be hired given pay in this job description if they respect all what I just mentioned and keep it in mind all times and keep in mind other their their parishioners are like disciples of Jesus. Those loved by his Holy Father so much that have to be respected as they themselves to be respected and consider this way to respect others, to set a good example physically and spiritually for them. And up to date in modern day with pandemic preventative measures easily done and has to be done by law and under God. They cannot be employed and make money if they don't respect this. There are trillions ministers, priests, and popes for years that have neglected this number one, what is their job. Trillions of people suffered, even with COVID, SARS before two weeks, and died. Most that are loving God the most. Devotes devout to the holy sacred heart of Jesus and Holy Spirit. We're never told by worship leaders and holy in heaven have to stand the guardian, angels, and protectors. Especially after they have to respect the lives of those people that physically suffered. We're never required to build the worship churches, places, synagogues, temples minister halls, Presbyterian Protestant churches, basilicas, cathedrals, built with over hundreds of years rather with many stones of clay, human digging, excavating deep, deep grounds, building stairs that are disrespectful of human health to walk up, or suffering to cold warm temperatures to get there. Got all virus, bacteria, fungus, mold, allergy affected, on the way there, and then spread this to other loved humans in the churches. While well, kneeled on hard surface, physically made the sign of the cross, harm squished and damaged nerve cells over exerted when too tired to get up on Sunday, and were required to rest by God, but never told him to do on earth. Enough to enforce this on earth and maintain this. 
Jesus the mercy even more after he went but went and prayed. Suffer got ill on the way like myself. Cold virus, runny nose, symptoms, coughing requires a fever. High fever to kill the virus, common cold, influenza even. Every Sunday for 19 years, even till 20 years old adult. When a child is myself and others growing new cells. Catholic went, but not informed, but right to know. Would have stayed home, and these people would have right to know and never built these worship places. If they know that it's going to people lead suffering on the earth, ill getting there, then when too tired, supposed to stay home and rest, because they have another school work week to go to and be a good example for others. Priests and ministers of all kinds in all religions and Pope failed to keep this on earth, to, t- to tell humans this. This still made pay and can't. They left. Every Mass has 100 to 1,000 people, even after four years of COVID, after millions suffered died with SARS. COVID is SARS-CoV-2. They all made mostly pay, neglected to think of them as God's representative on earth. To stay up to date, to tell them to never go to church. It is not worth the hell's human failing of God's loved humans. To get up when they're too tired on Sunday, as everyone knows, they're too tired after a long school work week and have to sleep. For their physicality to rest and function properly before another school long work week into cold warm temperatures. They can't physically help anyone if they're too tired and the health fails by going to church when too tired. When a human is too tired, is not ever expected to endanger the life to go to in cold temperatures outdoors. And or to warm or separately warm temperatures more than their physicality can handle according to the Holy Divine Almighty God. Loving grace of God the Father, the bio-life respecting laws, ethics, bioethics laws, health and safety board laws in place on earth with humans employed in these fields to make sure that these worship places were not opened, especially to, during the pandemic times. They all horrendously, almost all failed on this earth for over four years to close all worship places, St. Peter's Square in front of the Vatican, the Holy Light and Holy Land, the site is there in Jerusalem, in Poland, in Transtohova, and in France, in Lourdes, and other holy sites in the world. None of them in those sites are wearing a mask. And trillion people, they misinform putting the videos there every day. Recording a useless waste of time disrespectful to human health and life, holy rosary. Not even stating the intent of the prayer. Disrespecting their own health and wasting the time money of people watching this have no right to do as popes, priests, ministers of all religions. Never wore a mask. Never to enforce social distancing, promoted it as God's human representative of his laws. Respectful have to be of the trillion humans like Jesus would be of all trillion people tuning in in the world. For a good example to see of this priest, minister, bishop, archbishop, cardinal, vicar general, rabbi, Protestant, Presbyterian minister, Anglican ministers, the Dalai Lama, All other Christian Christ respecting, they are all judged on earth, made pay, hundred trillion people suffered and died. They didn't wear the mask. They're not wearing the mask on video. They are not allowed to make pay. As priests, ministers are not a good physical example for trillions of God love humans. They have no right to speak any holy rosary prayers. To the holy in heaven, about to pray for anyone. When they disrespect the trillion people and their whole lives failed. But you know, they are educated 
they have I know what studies are Christian studies and they study more years than I did Christ respecting the Holy God the Father to practice being a good physical example and for others and respecting Jesus that suffered died and went to heaven to make sure they respect the health and lives of others knowing that they're judged the Holy Spirit to respect the laws, preventative measures to look up on WHO, World Health Organization site, CDC, Center for Disease Control sites in world. It is easily done online. To consult with this and world leaders, the Pope, his job. To make sure everyone is healthy, safe, and respected, as they have a right and want to be respected. A valuable life, human dignity they have. All other living creatures affected, animals, have a life to be respected. Brain, emotions, personality, life force, soul, pets, dogs, loved animals they have in a womb. They have the most kind heart of them all. They have COVID spread to them because those in, not informed, keeping up to date with preventative COVID measures, not enforcing them to be promoted even, not enforcing social distancing, not even speaking about it. The Holy Rosary I mandated on the earth as human, real earth angel, humanitarian. I have authority, high rank in heaven, I have authority over the Pope, all world leaders, all world religious worship leaders and all humans of all job descriptions. I act and the only one on earth after all these years and they all made pay, not doing the job and truly suffered and still do. They're not respecting the holy grace of God or judged and I don't understand why. They still do, they know the consequences. When they die, if they don't rectify these on earth, the priests, ministers, knowing, didn't close worship places till the pandemic's gone, entirely at least. They have to respect the health, life, safety of humans first. Their own health, life, and safety. They don't want to become ill. They don't want to get COVID to consider this and to respect, be considered of others. They're not doing, then they easily be fired or let go and have to resign. And higher humans need jobs these days. And a human, there are many that work but couldn't get a job because those were hired, but they didn't do the job and truly suffered. Two weeks respiratory breathing problems, brain health concerns for two weeks and died. Children lost parents, became orphaned, no one to take care of them, million seconds, starved and died. No shelter at night, infants, toddlers crying for their parents. Animals left, pets loved, the pets, the pet owners died. And crying, have a soul looking for owner to help there that they love to see there, are not there anymore. Humans in long-term care facilities. Suffered there, I was there. Couldn't go outside even for air. Two did their part to prevent the spread of this. So if it spread prevented was the virus from one to another to animals, it would die out and be gone from the world. When a virus is on earth, it is very dangerous because it changes forms the longer it stays on earth. It becomes more virulent, travels faster, longer distances from one to another. The COVID-19 was not allowed to be happened on Earth. After those suffered at SARS, this is SARS-CoV-2, they haven't failed and can't, according to this, to respect human life and health of those that, like myself, prayed for years to prevent this from happening. It is never a human job to pray, for what the holy in heaven have holy grace of God reason knowledge of the laws know to respect God's love creation and monitor all times 
to provide the guardians there and archangels to monitor the earth so there are no viruses such as this that affect God's love creation ever. That is foreign to them that they don't even have antibodies to fight it off. This virus within them. The animals, birds. I human prayed myself. It is recorded to experience life. No different things affect and by heaven's side. An innocent human on earth. It is recorded in humans what humans prayed for others. But the next step is not always done by the holy in heaven. When humans are not required to, but my son had a right to be informed. But nonetheless went. I mandated this stop on earth so no one else fails ever again. So they're happy, healthy, staying home. Simple terms, never go to church. Your health is most important, more, most important rather, according to God and what I stated. Out of respect of the mother and womb, those that raised you for 20 years, everyone. The Pope and priests, all human representatives on earth, have to promote this from now on. Think of it themselves. If they're not going to resign, turn the pay in. Anyone and they said neglected the new days and people suffered have a moral obligation to rectify these with these humans on the earth before they die. To seek apology, apologize rather to them, seek forgiveness from these humans, the victims of COVID, HIV human immunovirus, SARS over the years, monkeypox, avian influenza virus, immune, the, rather, the influenza common cold. Humans affected by seasonal allergies, they had to these human representatives on earth, ministers, pope, priests, and still, they have to speak this online. Now they have the online masses every Sunday. Care for, respect, the health, lives, safety, and well-being, dignity, rights of their parishioners. Like disciples of Jesus, loved humans. Valuable life, everyone has a right to be respected. Their job to keep up to date on Sunday, and I created the online merciful information session. An online mercy session of a caring minister, priest, pope, and those of other religions. Got rid of the old useless harmful to health with harmful physical practices and harmful sacramental items that spread germs, virus, microbes, allergen, proteins of all kinds from one left human to animals to all to other humans, kids, those in womb for years. The priest, ministers, pope had to focus on this and the pandemics would not have resulted on the earth if they did their job and all other humans world leaders medical doctors psychiatrists pharmaceutical companies world health organization health safety boards the members have horrendously failed for years to do this job continuously trillions of lives and human health would not have failed Trillions of lives would not have been lost. The economy would not have gone down. Humans still had, would have jobs. This virus would have been contained, not spread. Two trillions in the world. Pets suffered and don't have reasoning abilities as human to figure what a virus is and go seek medical advice. Suffered and died, had infants, suffered, no parents to take care of, feed them. COVID is not even allowed on earth. It is not allowed by the Holy Divine Almighty God to affect a human, anything, a virus that is transmitted to an animal, or vice versa. There are many different species of animals. This has been going on earth way too long and is not allowable.
So out of respect of these people that were not informed, but really right to be by the holy grace of Almighty God, the holy loving grace of God the Father, Jesus Christ, the divine mercy, to prevent and relieve any suffering. What God is Father doesn't allow human, doesn't want him to suffer, that they don't deserve any, but they were prayed by humans, what well, they were left suffering on earth by the God and Jesus, who had holy powers, had to prevent it by law, out of respect of his loved God's creation, his father's creation, rather, all humans, those in womb, all animals, pets, loved living creatures, sea creatures, and wild, farm animals, insects, their little infants, birds, the eggs, everything, love flowers, plants, all have a very valuable life. Each one affects another life. Even to remind humans this, to stay home and wouldn't go to church and pollute and harm the little trees, hundred blades of grass. Each have a such valuable life with organic living cells that have a certain purpose of taking out CO2 that humans and animals and others breathe to and then release oxygen for them to have, to have clean air rather to breathe. We're harmed. The ozone layer depleted, pollution resulted horrendously, especially in warmer climates, acid rain, water is contaminated, polluted, decreased in amount over the years on earth, bacteria spread to water systems, viruses, These, if the worship places were never built in all religions, synagogues, temples, churches, humans would have been healthy, stayed at home. Never got cold too hot when too tired first, stayed home and rested on God's day of rest and bid a good example for themselves and others. Healthy, and then everyone would still have their family members, no parents, children lost. Animals loved and polluted environments seriously for years. Over the years, the vehicles were created with gas, gas stations, humans working hard, going to church on Sunday, every Sunday. That's 52 weeks, 52 times a year. And every week on Sunday more. And devout to loving God, respecting and Jesus, Holy Spirit. But had to think what the priests and them had to say in themselves as stated to respect their own health, mother, them and others. Be a good example physically, then then can go to the church. We're not allowed to go to have to stay home and be a good example for others. So the others would see that they stayed home, respected their health and life, and slept when they need to sleep on Sunday and rest. Respect God's day of rest. He rested after worked whole six weeks, days and nights, rather, creating the universe. So they don't sin against themselves, of their own health, are judged, recorded by heavens and every human, the priest, ministers, pope, Failed to be human representative of God and his right laws and ways. Health, safety, consider of others and themselves. The others health, lives and dignity. Their rights to be informed. If it's too cold for them to stay home, say, don't go to church. Your health is most important. They all failed mostly for years. They have no right to do. They may pay for it. And the millions suffered and no right to either. Out of respect of those though, but built these places and went there ill myself, but were not informed, but right to be. Went up the stairs too tired, went too cold, or they frostbite or froze cold muscles to get their child. Sweat before put snow suit on and go on outside and froze. Then walked the miles to the church or in cars with fumes from gas station, became brain and physically ill lungs, bloodstream, 
went then up the stairs that couldn't physically possibly walk when too cold, too tired, or in too hot temperatures, had to open a huge door that no human on earth can open, maybe 300 muscle pound man, well, little athlete. Every church, every worship place was built huge. There's not a little building welcoming short distance for human to walk to with a nice soft couch, a small room with food waiting there for someone to enter with a level ground entrance with no stairs. As would be more respectful of God's loved humans to a place to worship him than he sing any worthwhile song to him of praise if he actually did something right when he had to. These are all these places have been mandated by health safety boards for years to be closed, to never opened, never built in first place. There's not humans there enforcing to close the doors even during COVID after the four years. The Vatican, there are officers in place employed, study long years, the medical school other lengthy studies. Parents involved help pay for studies work. A lot of things have to be respect by one for another. Their mother that carried them, those that raised them, help them to be uh, do their job that respects others. Every job description is there for human to be a good example for themselves, healthy, educated, use what they learn, kindness from their own heart, soul, to, to work with others, respect others what their job is, health and safety enforcement and 